This is a message to Wavy P. Your regime in this community is over with. Your wickedness, your foolishness has been spreading like a virus in this community. And it's time that somebody steps up and stomps on your neck. So at 6 p.m. today, you will have an opportunity to step into my arena and defend yourself on some mental gladiator shit. To defend yourself against these allegations. To defend your knowledge, your information, to stand in your own truth, to proclaim your kingdom. And you will have every opportunity, right, to, to defend yourself against the scouting that's coming for you. I just want to let you know that no matter what you do, no matter what you say, you're going to get scouted, whether you like it or not. Now we can do this the easy way, or we can do it the hard way.
Let's get it. All right. So I want to speak on this whole wavy P situation, right? Because this shit is wild. This shit mad crazy, you know? Um, and I want to speak on it from the very beginning. I want to speak on how we got to this point, um, where we began from this point. And it, yo, like, yo, yo, like, can you hear me? Just let me know if you can hear me, guys. I'll be right back. Give me one second. Are we ready? Let's get it. We good? No echo, nothing? We good? All right, let's get it. Peace and love, everybody. Welcome in, welcome in. So I want to speak on this wavy shit, you feel me? Because this shit mad crazy, this shit mad insane. And I want to speak on how we got to this point to where we're at right now, right? And, and I think it's important because a lot of y'all are just now tuning in. A lot of y'all haven't noticed, um, you know, me before, things like that. So I just want to tell you a little bit about myself, how this all began and things like that, right? So I've been doing this spiritual journey for about two years now, okay? Um, I done lived in a van once already for about eight months in California. Um, I came back here when my mom got her leg cut up in three different places uh, from a boating accident. Um, and I had to get a job and things like that to help her pay her car and to help uh, like pay a bill around the house and my parents wouldn't lose their house, you know. So um, that's why I came back to Texas. And when I came back to Texas, you know, I um, ended up meeting Zoe down here and ended up staying out here for another year, getting things ready and planning with Zoe. So, um, you know, we're on our face. Uh, like a last four or five months before we head to van life, you know? So, um, I think it's important to understand that we start there and then start how we got into this whole way EVP situation, right? So, um, how I first came into way EVP was through World News' platform. Um, I tuned into a live stream to where, um, World News and Wavy, I, I assume, are going back and forth with another, like one another. Um, I, I would see way EVP comment within, um, you know, world news, uh, you know, posts and things like that, you know, like they were kind of like roasting each other. Uh, Wavy was kind of clout chasing world. Um, I'm going to call Wavy now. Uh, yeah, like he can come join if he wants. Um, I already sent him the request. Like we can send him again. Right. Yeah. So we'll see if he want to join. Right. If y'all see Wavy P down here, let me know so we can bring him in. Uh, I'll get the Kulu out and we'll, uh, things like that, right? So I saw him arguing in Cop Chasing World already, right? So when I clicked on Wavy P's page and I tuned into one of his lives, I saw him with Nature Boy, right? So at the time, Wavy P was riding Nature Boy's dick hard, you feel me? And Wavy P says he was acting, he said he was doing this, right? He said he was doing that, right? Um... But we can tell that he was cloud chasing uh, Nature Boy as if he, like, he, like, like he've already admitted it, right? And, th and there's a comment that said that I, I've been cloud chasing since the beginning. That's a lie, you feel me? Um, there's been times where I've had two or three people on my live stream, and I went on four or five hours doing um, mathematical breakdowns, chemistry breakdowns. There, there's some people that have been following me for the last two years that have been in my live stream. There's one or two people and has still seen me do full two-hour breakdowns, you know what I mean? So... I'm not in this for clout. I've been doing this for a minute. I actually don't want clout because of the technology and things that I'm building, you know, people get killed for turning or for building a, a engine that can run off water, you know, especially when we tap into sound frequencies, it's like, especially with my devices that can emit ultrasonic frequencies that can deter any type of animal away from you within a, a 10 to 15 foot radius around uh, a circumference radius around your body, right? This type of technology, right? If people get killed for it. You know, these are billion dollar ideas, million dollars ideas, right? So when people say I'm chasing clout, I just laugh because it's like, why would I want to be known? You feel me? Like if like if I'm known and I'm creating these technologies, I'm, I'm a threat. I'm a threat to the system. You know what I mean? So they're going to want to kill me or they're going to want to uh, you know, hinder me in any way, you know? So I studied from Malcolm X. I studied from Martin Luther King. I believe that the reason why they died was because they had a too big a following. You know, and that's something that I wanted to uh, like stay away from, you know what I mean? On my journey and things like that is I wanted to remain low key. And 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 once we do the land and get everything built, you know what I mean? I'm not going to be on live. I'm not going to be on live stream every day showing you all this shit. You feel me? Once everything gets built, 
right? It's 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 over with, right? So that's how I came into WBP is through World News, and I saw that he was riding Nature Boy's dick, right? He was uh, fucking with the whole Nature Boy wave, right? He was calling him him his Messiah. He even has videos of him um, is saying that he went to war for the Messiah, that he was debating him against all the trolls, right? And then, right, once Wavy, once Nature Boy switched up on Wavy P, right, then Wavy P began exposing Nature Boy, right? All of the secret messages, all of the uh, conversations, right? He started going around different news platforms, my platform, other platforms, right? Um, um, and he's talking shit about Nature Boy. And y'all try to tell him, right? Like, it, like some of y'all that are watching this live right now have told Wavy that, like, yo, like, we try to tell y'all that Nature Boy was on some fuck shit, right? But Wavy had a plan the entire time. Right, he was only clout chasing for the views, for the Instagram views. He would only join the live for the followings, for the followers. Right, um, and and I peeped that when I first met him. Right, so me as a person that understands um, fourth dimensional and fifth dimensional chess. Right, I knew Wavy was good at what he does. Right, from how he 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 trolled Nature Boy to how we switched to Solar and how we just been maneuvering from the that that uh, that homosexual guy that they created a skit with and those other people. Right, I noticed that he was good at what he does. Right, so when we first came in contact, right, was after I done dismantled Chief uh, or or um or what y'all call Nature Boy or or what was known at the time was you know was was uh wavy's chief at the time his messiah you know so wavy p came into contact with me after he saw that video of me debating um um nature boy right um that's when he began telling me that i was super smart super intellectual all this shit right and i knew that he was feeding right into my hands right so i just want to let y'all know is that i planned for this to happen right and i and, and if wavy p you're listening right i know exactly what move you're gonna do Right. And I'm going to go ahead and expose that move because I've already planned this three weeks ago. Right. And everybody that's been watching me for a minute. Right. Knows how 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 smart I am. And I don't like to brag about it, but I like to play four or five moves ahead. Right. And then let the person's actions decide on what pathway we take. Right. So notice and I want you all to peep this. Right. I want you all to peep how good of a guy I am. Right. And the reason why I'm saying this is because I never once attacked Wavy's character. When, like, when have you heard me once attack his character? Right? When have you heard me once right, talk about this dude's past outside of the allegations of which we just heard? Right? When have you once heard me talk about his character? Okay. When have you once heard me talk about his past outside of these allegations that have just recently came up? Right. Have you seen any posts from the DMs or from my messages about me and Wavy's personal conversations? Uh, we're not talking to each other. Wavy, uh, Wavy's not really spiritual uh, goddess, uh, Mama, uh, like Mama Tareem is. Uh, like Wavy is not part of this conscious community, right? He hopped on a uh, Nature Boy train, and Nature Boy basically flung him in into this community. Right? So, have y'all seen me do any of that? Okay? And the reason why I'm, I'm, I'm asking y'all is because there's a certain road that I won't take to certain people. Because I'm just a good dude. Right? So, if you tell me something within our personal direct messages, right? I keep that private. Unless that code is broken. Okay? So, I just want to, just to let y'all know. All these lives that you see me scalping people, I have struck... I have stuck strictly to the knowledge. I haven't talked about nobody's character. And I haven't talked about nobody's past. And used it against them. Okay? In any of the live streams that y'all see me do, I haven't done this. Okay? So I'm just letting y'all know there's a certain level that I won't go. Right? Because I have certain morals and principles that I ride by. And, and, and I just want to let y'all know that y'all haven't seen me do that. Right? See him doing what he's doing. Right? He's showing you his character. Right? Which the entire time I knew he would do eventually. And, and this is what people don't understand, right? Y'all saw me messing with Wavy and things like that, right? Me and Wavy have only developed one frequency, one connection, and, and that was through humor, right? That was through comedy, right? I'm a comedy guy. You know, I wanted to be a comedian back in the day, 
right back before I awaken and things like that. I wanted to be a comedian, you know. I wanted to um um be like Key and Pill. Have y'all seen the show Key and Pill? Oh yeah, I'm working on that goddess. Um, I apologize for saying right a lot, right? But I um, just did it then, right? But oh, there we go. But um, have y'all seen the show Key and Pill? Right, Key and Michael Pill, right, and all of them. I wanted to do things like that, you know what I mean? But more in a spiritual sense. I wanted to bring more comedy, right, to the spiritual community. I feel like in this uh, like spiritual community, you know, we have the whole BS BS. Right with the whole like nature boy BS, and then we have stuff that's taken too serious. I feel like there needs to be an in between pathway, you know. And and I've been I you know I, you know have been inspired by Key and Pill, and I knew that Wavy just a natural like you know funny dude like um, yes like not funny as in like he's he has real intellectual humor, but it just his energy um, in person, right? His energy in person. It's just a funny, he, he, he's just a funny entity, you know, his, his, his whole entire demeanor, his voice down to his look, down to his action, just like it's just humorous, right? So we developed a connection over that aspect, right? Over that comedy frequency. Count, right? I, like, I really want y'all to count. It's like that movie um, Hustle and Flow when um, my brother kept saying Maine a lot. Have y'all, have, like, have y'all observed that movie Hustle and Flow? Like, if y'all do, like, go back and watch that and count how many times this dude says me in that movie. Like, that's how much times I say right, right? Um, so, I'm just letting you know the beginning aspects to this whole entire breakdown, okay? So, me and Wavy have only developed one connection and, and that's through uh, comedy, right? So, let me break down what he's trying to do now, right? So, now he's trying to say that he's going to expose some voice recordings of me, right? And I, and I know exactly what voice recordings he's going to expose, right? Because what Wavy don't realize is that I knew he was going to do this. <laughs> and, and, and here's the funny thing, right? Here's the funny thing, right? I didn't expect it to happen so soon, right? But I expected for him to expose himself, right? I knew his patterns, for, it's, it, it's how we did Nature Boy, how we did World News, right? And how he's done everybody else up until this point, right? So my thing is, is that I knew he was going to try to expose me in some type of light or some type of way when he disagreed with me, when I didn't serve his purpose anymore, right? So... right so far that's funny oh yeah oh yeah and and that's the thing like all this has to stem with young pharaoh all this has to be about young pharaoh because that's who he's chasing he's not chasing me he's not chasing nature boy he's chasing brother the polite and he's chasing young pharaoh right and the reason why is because he wants their views he wants their clout he wants the people in in in, in his lives that's all he wants okay so when i get into the story about how me and wavy uh developed our connection and how everything went down is you're gonna start seeing right the the hidden agenda of wavy p right so as y'all see wavy p posted uh my goddess delina okay wavy p as y'all seen recently just posted my goddess delina right and then he wants a dmer right saying man i wish i had the, man, I wish I had the message right that me and kulu Right, scripted this, right? This is what he's gonna try to tell you, right? That me and Kulu scripted this, right? That I purposely, right, DM them saying to DM my girl on some on some cool shit to act like, right, some like to create some fake beef. But what he don't realize is, right, I did say that. I did say that. Right? But what Wavy P don't realize and what he's not gonna show you is the full context of the conversation that we had, right? Mind you, right, mind you, right, me and Zoe are going up to New York as one of our, um, bro, like, for real, for real, I agree, right, I, like, I agree, but Wavy P took it out of context, right, but I knew he would do this, I knew his character and his traits and his behaviors would manifest this scenario, which is why I'm speaking on it now, right, notice I haven't talked about his character, 
haven't talked about his past. Notice all the stuff that he's been doing to everybody else, right? When it came to Immortal Naomi, right? Calling her out, posting that suicide video, trying to basically, um, you know, put you know put that type of energy out in the universe. Like who posts that? Like who posts that? Like who posts a a a a a, a, a video of a person saying that they're going to commit suicide to try to discredit the person's information, right? That, like that stuff is real serious. Like that's some real stuff. So, so like when I see that, I knew the 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 level of 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 clout he will go to try to creep up some type of drama to try to create some type of views, right? So mind you, me and my goddess have been planning this New York trip for a minute, right? We're actually gonna go see a New York Knicks game and a New York Giants game. I've never been to a football game, NFL game outside of the Kansas City Chiefs back when I was younger, right? My favorite teams are the New York Giants and the New York Knicks, right? So we were planning. Okay, on, on building the van and taking up to New York, okay, to go see a New York Giants game, to go see a New York Knicks game, why they're still playing, right? Obviously, the football's over, you know, like, like, like football season's over with, right? What, like, 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 what to catch next season, okay? But basketball season's still here, right? Now, right, me and Wavy built a connection on comedy. Right. So what y'all have to understand is me and Wavy were planning on doing some Key and Peele skits. Right. Have y'all seen the show Key and Peele? Who, my brother, who's getting burned? Uh, James Society, who's getting burned? Right. But have y'all seen the show Key and Peele? Right. Me and Wavy were going to create skits like that. Okay, but on some spiritual conscious information, right? So not to give you any type of information on the actual skits because I'm actually creating the skits myself. Now I'm pushing Wavy to the side and I'm going to do it myself. So now me and my queen and whoever is in our reality at the time are going to be inside these skits, right? And the same thing that you see Key and Pill posting on their YouTube, them five minute, um, you know, you know, like comedy skits, is we're going to be doing the same exact thing, just in a more uh, spiritual version, Okay. So, me and Wavy developed a wavelength over that, right? So, the voice notes that he's going to play for you guys, talking about, right, um, the different scenes and stuff like that that we were planning on doing, right? Because we had one video that, that, uh, that was me, was to show how a king wasn't supposed to treat a woman and how a real king was, right? And, and now he's trying to turn this Instagram shit into that skit. And then now he's going to try to use my voice notes, little two-minute voice notes. And for anybody that really knows me and that really um, DMs me, y'all know that I send personal voice notes rather than texting. Okay. Oh, yeah. I went live. Yes, I used to go live every day. Every day I used to be live. Ask, ask anybody in the room that used to follow me. I used to be alive every day, three or four hours, breaking down mathematics, science, and all this shit. You feel me? I, I've been doing this for a minute, and I know um, it's Liddy. It can explain that. I know um, my brother, uh, Ed, or as is divine, can explain that. Like the goddess can explain that. There's so many people that have been following me before, have been tuning in, have you know, like can validate that I've been going live for the longest, for the last two years, right? Man, I've been doing this for the last two years, right? So me and Wavy only developed that relationship over those key and pill skits, right? And that's what we were talking about. So, the stuff that he's going to show y'all right now, right, is literally voice notes of me talking about the skits, right? And he's going to try to say that this is the skit, which this isn't the skit, right? I use voice notes to everybody. You can ask Footneck. You can ask, um, you know, because me, like, like me and Footneck message. You can ask uh, Isis Divine. You can ask Star, right? I send everybody voice notes, right? So, what he's doing, right? It's just like a random person just screenshotting a voice note and posting it saying that he's going to expose me. But mind you, I want you to know this. Okay? I want you to know this. Right? Notice how he, right, when these allegations were made about him, right, he did everything he can try to, dis uh, try to discredit Naomi when Naomi was telling the truth the entire time. Okay? Now mind you, and I'm I, like, have a screenshot on my other phone. So if Wavy doesn't want to show y'all the entire voice, see, and, and, and this is the thing. Tell Wavy to show y'all the entire voice note. Tell Wavy to play the entire, uh, the entire archives of all of our messages. 
I guarantee you he won't do that. Right? Oh, yeah, no, like, we leveling up, goddess. Right? But I just had to make this known to the world, right, that I don't associate with Wavy. Right? We've only connected over um, that, that, that whole script, uh, uh, that whole key and pill uh, video YouTube thing that we're doing. Right? And over this shit, the, uh, the whole Nature Boy and Solar shit. That's the only thing that we connected. I've only known this dude for three weeks. Not longer than that. Only three weeks. I've only known this dude. Okay? So, he's going to try to do everything he can to try to discredit me. Right? So that y'all don't believe what I'm saying. The same way that Naomi, that he tried to do Naomi, but world caught him up in the lies. The same way he tried to do Nature Boy. Right? Once Nature Boy did him wrong, what did he do? He started exposing the, 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 the videos. Right? He started saying that he was going to be with Raw when that wasn't even happening. When Raw was telling him, right, not to do it. Raw was telling him to stop messaging him. Raw was telling him to stop calling me. Right? Raw, Raw was telling him to stop posting her because he was trying to make Nature Boy mad. Right? He tried to make Nature Boy mad. But what Wavy P don't know is that I knew he was going to do this. What Wavy P don't realize is that I knew he was going to throw himself underneath the bus and expose himself, which he did. Right? So let's get into that expose. Right, let, right, let's get into the scalping because this is why we're here, right? And don't show Wavy no love, you feel me? Like, don't show him no love. Um, oh, yeah. No, he, he's not blocked on Jukulu. He's blocked on Dukulu, right? Not on Jukulu. He's not blocked. No, he's not blocked. I can't go live on Dukulu. And I've already sent Wavy a request already on, like, Jukulu, and he hasn't sent one back, right? And we're private. Oh, oh yeah, no, so he can't see this one. No, he will though, because I'll, I'll turn this unprivate. Um, oh yeah, on my Instagram, the Kulu, I'm blocked, but you can still go through lives through other people's platforms, right? So I can still join other people's lives, I just can't go live on my own personal platform when I'm blocked, right? Um, he's not blocked on Jukulu. He's not blocked, and I can show you that, right? Um, Did you tell him to go around telling Solar that he had to go through him first? No, I didn't tell him that. No, he just did that on his own. Like, he just did that on his own. Like, okay, so the thing about Wavy, right? Um, can we tag you over there? Yeah, like, yeah, like, do what you want. Like, like, yeah, like, do what you want. Tag me over there. But you gotta remember, this is private. This account's private. So I can end the live. I'm, I'll make it private and he can come in and speak his piece. Right? I, I, do y'all want that? Is let me know in the chat. Do y'all want that? Is let me know in the chat. Do you, like, like, do you want to hear me, Wavy, and talk about this, or do y'all just want me to tell y'all to build? Like, just tell y'all to hit the beans. I can show you right now. Do you want me to bring him in? Okay. I'll finish my piece first, and then we'll see him alive, right? So, we've only met through those aspects, through those fears, through those um, wavelengths, right? It's through comedy and through this whole Nature Boy Solar shit, right? So, Solar group me and Nature Boy together, so we had to kind of come together and beef on that shit. You feel me? So, we developed a wavelength on that. So, Wavy, right? And, and, and I have the screenshots to show y'all, right? This dude, and it, 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 it's crazy because, you know, for me, I want to look at everybody and have a optimistic light. You know, I want to look at everybody and have a positive light. I want to look at everybody and hope that they are a good person inside. You know, I want to have optimism in the world. I want to have hope. I don't want to look at everybody as if I can't trust them and I got to, you know, you know, is, is that they have to do things within my mind for them, you know, for, like for me to allow myself to open up to them. You know what I mean? I don't want to have to, um, you know, look at the world that way in a, um, such a, a disloyal way. You know, I kind of want to be optimistic. You know what I mean? Optimistic. Um, so when I was looking at Wavy and I noticed that all of y'all were telling me the truth. All of y'all were telling me that this dude was a cloud chaser. All of y'all were telling me, um, um, that this dude, uh, following Nature Boy, all of y'all were telling me this, right? All of y'all were telling me this, and I apologize for not listening to you. It's like, especially Delina, if she's listening, right? Because my own queen has told me not to be fucking with Wavy P. 
even on some comedy, like even on the frequency that we were operating with, Delina and Zoe even told me not to stop fucking with them, right? But I ignored my goddess's intuition, and I was like, you know what? Like, I want to be optimistic. Like, I feel like, you know, he, you know, he can be a good dude. You know what I mean? So I went against them, and I trusted Wavy, right? And now you're seeing what happens when you give your trust to this dude. Now you see what happened, right? Nature Boy gave his trust to Wavy P, and what did he do, right? He showed him, he showed everybody the voice messages and screenshots, right? Raw gave him his trust. Raw gave her her trust, and he broke that by telling everybody that he was bringing Raw into the relationship, right? Wavy, Wavy breaks everybody's trust. Facts, and, and, and that's my mistake. I went against my own goddess's intuition, and that's my mistake. This is the lesson that I uh, that the universe is teaching me, right? In fact, I I, I am hard headed. Like like I'm not gonna lie to you, you know, I am hard headed, but I do learn from certain instances. But certain instances, I don't, you know. So I admit this. I take this L. You feel me? And I apologize, Delina. I apologize, uh, like Goddess I, is for putting you in this situation because you're right. It was my fault, you know. But I just want to let the people know that I should have listened to y'all. I should listen to like Delina first. Um, I'm gonna get him. Right, but I just have to like lay out the groundwork to let y'all know that I apologize to all the women in here, right? That 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 came into my life and telling me to block him, right? And I ignored. Right? I apologize to all the women that uh, that I threw under the bus by bringing him onto my lives and things like that. I apologize to all the men that told me. I apologize to the world. I apologize to Footneck. I apologize to S. L. Davis. I apologize to everybody because I feel like this whole shit is because of me. If this dude wouldn't have rolled my, like, if I wouldn't have rolled on Nature Boy's ass like that, then he wouldn't have tried to hop on my train and try to use me to get Young Pharaoh, right? Is using me to get, like, Young Pharaoh. So this, is, so this is my fault, and I take responsibility, you know? And whatever comes with it, I come with it. But I'm just letting you know that he won't play the entire, um, yes, I'm a Capricorn. I'm a Capricorn sun. I'm a, a Aquarius moon. My Mercury's in Capricorn. My Mars is in Capricorn. And my Venus is in Aquarius, you know what I mean? So I'm straight Capricorn Saturn out, you know? But, um, oh yeah, oh yeah, facts, I'm all, like, and this is the thing, right, Wavy thinks that he's gonna stop my life, like, Wavy thinks that what he's gonna post and do or say, whatever he does, is gonna stop me from living van life, like, Wavy thinks that he's gonna stop me from buying a van, like, like, Wavy don't even know that we already got our van right now, right, how, how, how is what Wavy's gonna do gonna stop me from living with my two goddesses? On a beach, you know, how is Wavy, you know, life going to do that? It's not going to hinder me. So him trying to say he will end my career, right? My career wasn't even built off Wavy. Wavy's career was built off me. And this is from the words of Naomi herself, right? So I'm just letting y'all know what Wavy's going to try to tell y'all, right? He's going to try to show y'all the voice notes, little two-minute voice notes when I done sent 10 voice notes, right? And anybody that knows me that really messages me, I send 10 Almost five to six, seven different voice notes. I can speak for a long time. And I know some people get like pissed off at me because I'll be sending almost nine to ten voice notes. Right? So he's not going to play a ten-minute voice note of all the his, his questions and then my answers. He's going to play you a little two-minute, a little minute clip of one little voice note that I said to try to paint a picture. He's not going to show you the entire DMs and play the entire di like DMs. Right? He can't join because it's private. He never followed me on this account. Wavy P never followed me on this account. This account's private, right? So after this live, I'm going to uh, end it and then bring him back in. But I just want to apologize to Delina personally for putting you in a situation. Apologize, you know what I mean? Because you shouldn't have no man that, that, that says he was friends with me in your DMs trying to take you, you feel me? And things like that. And he's taking what we talked about out of context. What he don't know is that we were going to meet him in New York to shoot these key and P videos, these key and peel videos. You know, what he don't know, right, that that we were going to do that, right? He thought we were going to do it over Instagram Live, and, and, and that's where he fucked up. That's where he fucked up, right? It's where he thought that I meant over Instagram Live. I'm going to New York in the next six, seven months. So that's when I was planning on doing these videos with him, right, over Oh, like over that time, we would have developed a connection. I would have helped him got his GED, like he asked me to. I would have helped him. Um, it became a little bit smarter, like he asked me to do. Right? The how is he gonna say 
I was a member of Carbon Nation and then defend against Solar to, and say that I wasn't. This just shows you that he's trying, right, to, to, is to create clout in some type of way, right? So it doesn't surprise me that he's going back to Nature Boy, that he's trying to go back to somebody else, right? It doesn't surprise me because I knew he was going to do this. I knew he was going to expose himself when we first met. That's why I'm a tisky, I, I precisely place certain things in his reality. I, I purposely sent him certain videos, right? Of Nature Boy, of, of the whole hair crown thing like that. I purposely placed him in, and was pulling him like his little string. He don't even know it, right? He, like he don't even know it, right? And he's trying to create clout so he can distract y'all from World News' um, Surviving Wavy P interview. Amazing story, right? If, if, if y'all haven't seen the interview, go watch it. It's called Surviving Wavy P. It's on World News' platform. He gets both, like, like World News gets both sides and the people's perspective. And you'll be able to decide for yourself, right? So, Wavy P, right? Like, this is how bad I felt for him, you know what I mean? And me, I'm a good heart. You know, this is my Aquarius moon. You know, and I'm not really into astrology like that, but Delina and Zoe have been getting into it, so they've been kind of showing me a little bit about it, you know? So, for real, we need to call eyes. And, oh, yeah, and that's what I'm going to speak about next. I actually have an uncle that's a Brooklyn police officer, right? That That is my brother, or my uncle's brother. That's a Wichita Falls police officer. So I'm going to talk about that next because Wavy keeps wanting to play in games. But let's see, right, if he's really doing his shit legitly, right? Because this dude sell, says he's selling crack. And I didn't want to do, like, bro, I didn't want to explain this shit. I didn't want to get this low and shit like that, you feel me? Notice I haven't talked about his character or his past. Bro, he did not make me. Wavy did not make me, bro. I've been on the internet for two years. I, I, I got videos and van life pictures of everything for the last two years. You feel me? I had videos five months ago on my Kulu's Universe. All right, guys, go, guys, go, guys, go to one of my YouTubes. Just type in Kulu's Universe. If Wavy really met me, right, then I would have known Wavy back when I made those two videos. All right? So now, right? I felt bad for Wavy, right? Because this dude really, like, came to me and said, yo, like, I don't have my GED, you know, like, you're really intelligent and smart, and I feel like I can learn a lot from you, more than nature. But, like, that's what he came and told me, which I believe, right, that he was only telling me that to boost me so that he can put me against Young Pharaoh. And all this has to do with Young Pharaoh. Mind you, how does Young Pharaoh have to play in this? All this has to do with Young Pharaoh, right? Because, remember, Young Pharaoh came into his platform, Right? And boosted up Wavy P's views to 300, 400 views. Do y'all remember that live? Like, let me know for the people in the room. Do y'all remember that live? Where Young Pharaoh and, and Wavy P went at it. Right? Wavy P tried to boost me and try to say, right? Like, Wavy P thought that I was just like Nature Boy. Right? He thought that I cared about being the most intelligent person on the planet. He thought I cared about having the master title. Which is what he called me, right? Which I had to tell him, bro, I don't care about that shit. Right? So, y'all all seen that interview or that video that Young Pharaoh did with him, right? Exposing him. What, what Wavy tried to do, he ain't never seen nobody scout Chief like that or scout Nature Boy like that. Right? So he wanted to use me to try to scout other people in this Instagram community as he rides my tailback, as he rides my, my, my tailbone or my cape. Right? He tried to put me up against Young Pharaoh a week and a half after I met this dude. Oh yeah, Pat. Oh yeah, Pat. I'm just explaining um, like, like, like what happened here. Right? I want the people to know why this situation has even came into existence because a lot of people have just now tuned into my platform and they think that I'm all about the drama and I'm all about the stuff when I'm really not. You know what I mean? So I want to explain how we got to this point before I bring Wavy P in and, 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 and I mean, him tell y'all's y'all's perspective, okay? Right? Yes, um, they're in the back. They're in the back. Right? Oh, there, oh, there's an echo? Right. So... Facts. 
Oh, oh yeah. And after this video, and after um he comes in, I'm done addressing him from now on. You know, he's no longer a part of my reality. He's no longer going to hinder me in no other way. You're going to see me get back to my knowledge, back to my information. I don't care who watches because I know that they don't have the science and the and the internal mechanisms to uh, to apply it to steal it. Hey, babe. Okay. I love you. Uh, do you have the key? No. Okay. Well, I ain't going to rob in here. Okay. Yo, can y'all hear me? I hear the echo too. I'll be back. I'll be right back, guys. So we don't break down situation. community and 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 that's it so to delina i apologize for not listening to your intuition i apologize for for um for not trusting you you know what i mean so then not like now i know right now i know and for now on right I'll, as, as i'm gonna go based off your intuition as whatever the goddesses tell me i'm gonna do it you feel me i'm gonna trust your intuition because I feel like they're going to have my best interest at heart, even though I'm still learning and growing. Like I feel like subconsciously, you know, on a heart frequency level that their hearts, you know, will look out for me more than my own heart will, you know. And and yes, I love myself. And, and when I mean love myself, I don't mean CLS, right? Um, obviously, all of y'all should love yourselves, okay? But, um, yeah, you know, I'm going to trust your intuition. I'm going to trust my goddess's intuition. Right, and Wavy P is not part of the conscious community. He's never been part of the conscious community. He never has been. Look at his builds. Um, and, and I mean, that's Delina right here, guys. This is my other queen that Wavy P tried to DM and message and try to steal and try to basically bring her into sex trafficking. Right? That's basically what Wavy P did. And what Wavy P don't realize is that I have an uncle who's actually... A, a, a New York police officer, a, actually a Brooklyn police officer, right? And we know that Wavy P stationed out of Brooklyn. So you know what I'm going to do, Wavy? How about we call my uncle right now? And we get in contact and we let him know about your whole ordeal. And Wavy P's mad, right? Because his escort pages are deleted. Have y'all want to go look up those pictures anymore? Th they're all gone. Right? They're all gone. Now, he's mad because now his money's fucking up. Those pages is how Wavy P was paying his rent. That's how he was buying his weed. Bet, bet. And someone check it out, like, after this live. Right? Wavy P tried to recruit my queen for sex trafficking. So you want to play Wavy P? Let's get the laws involved, involved, my brother. Let's get the laws involved. You feel me? My, my man, both my uncles are police officers, law enforcement. My cousin, who's 21 right now, is in the police academy right now. You feel me? So let's really put the pressure on your ass, right? Let's really put the pressure on your ass, wavy, right? You want to talk all this shit. You want to call out real niggas, but you don't know what family members that everybody has within this room. You don't know, right, this type of stuff. So while you're over here exposing yourself, you don't even realize that we can record all your lives and use it as evidence against you, that you're sex trafficking. You don't even realize that. You don't realize that World News' platform can be used by a lawyer to say that you sex trafficking. He said, fuck the police. You, you say fuck the police, but I guarantee you, if you were in a police presence, you wouldn't be saying that. You know, all y'all say fuck the police, but in their presence, y'all listen. Fuck the police and all this shit, but ain't none of one of y'all. Ain't, ain't, ain't one of y'all stand up to the police. Right? Right? And this is my thing is, right? I wasn't going to give, do any of this. 
Wavy P's actions, right, has brought him this. Wavy P's actions has brought him this. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we got 2017, we got photos of everything, right? So if Wavy P, see, you, you say it's not against her will, but I can prove it's against her will. I can prove against her will. You want me to prove that it's against her will? See, y'all think that they have to consciously agree to it, right? But what happens if they're smoking weed? What happens if they get drunk? Like, what happens if a woman gets drunk and then gets raped? Is her, is, is her account still valid? No, I haven't called the police on them, right? But if Wavy P really wants to keep fucking around, right? We have the evidence to lock this nigga up for a long time. And if they're doing crack, because that's what Wavy P said. Right. This is what Wavy P said. Right? That he sells crack on World News' platform. Go go watch the video. Wavy P, you started something you couldn't finish, brother. And I haven't even gotten to the information to scalp you yet. I'm just letting you know that you keep trying to ch clout chase people. Ain't nobody snitched if he admitted it on... Um, World News' platform. He admitted it on World News' platform. Go look it up. It was screen recording you did, but like, but like yesterday. He didn't say no weed. Yes, he didn't say weed. Go look it up. Go, like, yo, like, go re-listen. Right? So now, right, let's get into the information before we bring Wavy P in. Right? So... I explained how me and Wavy P basically connected, right? I explained how um, Wavy P's actions has manifested this experience, right? I wasn't the one in New York, you know what I mean, with him in that three uh, polygamy relationship, treating Naomi like that. I wasn't the one who did that. I wasn't the type, right? I wasn't the one. Who, who abused Naomi. I wasn't the one who kept her in the house for three weeks. I'm going to bring him in. Just give me a second. Just, bro, just give me a second. Like people say that I'm soft for beef and shit like that. But that's how I know these niggas that are saying that are real weak in real life. And will get slapped the fuck in real life. Did, like this dude BJ74, he, he, he says fuck a police officer, but I guarantee you he's going to be like, yes, sir. Yes, sir. When a police officer speaks to him, right? So stop all that tough Tony talk, my nigga BJ, because you're not really about that shit in real life. You know damn well when a police officer comes to you in real life, you're going to be like, yes, sir. No, ma'am. And, and brother, you're going to do exactly what he says, right? So don't play BJ like you really, so, like, like somebody special, Right? So let's get into it. Mind you, Wavy manifested this. He snitched on his own self. I wasn't the one that asked those, those questions. I wasn't the one that was on World News Platform. Right? I wasn't the one who did that. That wasn't me. That was Wavy exposing himself. Okay? Now let's talk about Young Pharaoh. Because this is all about Young Pharaoh. This whole thing was about Young Pharaoh. Wavy's whole plan was to hop into different people's lives that had a lot of different views. To steal their following so that whenever he went live, he would have 130. He would have 140. See, like, I know, like, BJ saying fuck the police. But I guarantee you, he'll say yes, ma'am, no, ma'am. And obey like a child in front of their presence. You feel me? So he says all that shit, but he's not really about that tough Tony talk. If he was really about tough Tony talk, he would break his niggas out of prison. If he was really about to tell Tony Talk, he would study how to make guns and weapons to, and to make his own ammo so he can grind up and build a million ammos and give it to his people. If he was really about that, fuck the police shit. But that's how I know he's not. All right, so we're going to get BJ74 out of here. Wavy, I see you, brother. Like, you don't got to keep saying it. And I didn't block him, right? I see you, Wavy. 
I see you. Is can you be patient for a second? This is how I know that you want to come in here and and lie. It's not. I, I mean, I didn't block you. This account is private. How can I block you if this account is private? I'm gonna bring you in, Queen Sandy. I think that's true. Like, damn, relax. Like, why are you trying so hard to get in here? Like, you see the views going up? Is that why? Like, 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 like I'm gonna bring him in here and I'm gonna let him speak his piece. And I have specific questions I want to ask him because me and you were cool, brother. Or at least I thought I was. I thought we were cool, right? From your perspective, you might be trying to play me the entire time, which is okay. Which I, which I want you know to see if that is really real, right? So let's talk about Young Pharaoh real quick. Wavy, why did you try to put me against Young Pharaoh? Why did a bro? Why did a three weeks? Why did two weeks, brother? After this time, why did two weeks, brother? After we done build, you want to do a live streams? Do Kulu versus Young Pharaoh? Do y'all remember that, guys? Right? Do y'all remember when Wavy P went live and said the Kula versus Young Pharaoh? Right? We were not discussing Young Pharaoh. Wavy P asked me and told me, yo, like, you're really smart. You're really in the intellect, man. No, nobody in Instagrams can fuck with you. This is what he tried to tell me. And I got the voice notes to prove it. And if he was real, he would play his own voice notes. Play the whole conversation, Wavy. Don't just play the little two, three minute clip that you're going to play. Play the entire. You know what? You know, do a whole entire live stream and go over, right, every message that I sent for two hours. Go over it and, and, and show the people the truth. Don't snip it like a one, two, or three. Bro, like, don't snip it like a one minute, two minute thing because people who really fuck with me know that I sent four, five, six, seven different voice notes talking about one different thing. So, so if you just record two minutes of a voice note and want to proclaim that that is what it is, it's not it, right? But you say we got you. All right, bet. Bet. Right, so Wavy tried to bring me in to a beef with Young Pharaoh. Right? And, and like, it wouldn't surprise me if Young, if Wavy behind my back was DMing Young Pharaoh saying that I was talking shit about him. Right? That wouldn't surprise me. Right? If Young Pharaoh. Or if, if, if Wavy, right? Because this is what Wavy told me. Wavy told me, yo, Dukulu, man, I saw the way that you scout chief. Yo, that was real. I ain't never seen nothing like that. You're smart. Ain't nobody on, the, on these, like, bro, this is what he said. Ain't nobody on these Instagram streets can fuck with you. You should definitely go after Young Pharaoh. He got the following. He got the knowledge, right? It's, man, I can see it now, man. Y'all two just going at it. And this is what he said. Then after I told him, nah, bro, I don't fuck with Young Pharaoh. Right? I wanted to debate him on some knowledge, right? But when it came to real life building and real life growing, I wanted to build with him. I didn't want to debate him or scalp him or, or, or talk shit about him like Wavy wanted me to do. Wavy just wanted to use me to focus on Young Pharaoh so all of y'all can be focused on Young Pharaoh. All the media platforms can be focused on Young Pharaoh so we won't focus on the sex trafficking shit that Wavy was doing. Now it's starting to make sense, right? Now it's starting to make sense. This whole entire time, Wavy has been trying to clout chase to create distractions. Oh, yeah, he was playing me. Oh, yeah. I knew he was playing me, right? I played Mr. Gullible, right? I played Mr. Gullible, right? But Wavy was hopping around live, live, live to live, my life. Nature Boy's life, World News' life, Pharaoh's life. There's no telling what type of lives. He probably hopped in Chakra Bars' life trying to start drama, right? So he tried to create all of this beef between the Instagram and conscious community. Why? So that all the media platforms, SL Davis, World News, uh, The T, all these platforms would be focused on the beef that he's causing between me, Yo Pharaoh, Nature Boy, World, and all this shit. So that people won't focus on the sex trafficking. So that Naomi wouldn't have 
a space to tell her story. Ah, uh, fuck it. He can leave because he knows I'm telling the truth. If he really real, if he really want to tell the truth, he'll wait until the entire bill. If he really real. Just like I waited that entire bill with Solar, when him and Solar went at it. I waited that entire bill to get in there with Solar and hopped in there with Solar because I knew Solar was lying. If Wavy's really real, he'll wait to the end of the bill to hop in here. Right? So Wavy... No, I didn't want to debate Nature Boy. The only reason why I went and, and, and scout Nature Boy was because of Isaiah doing what he did to my queen. Right? Doing what he did to my queen... And and him taking that information, him him taking the spiritual rhetoric, and 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 he was using it to manipulate women. And Isaiah, December twenty second, right, just a month ago, posted a picture about polygamy with her in it, a video that that, that they did personally, and tried to use it to convince the women that he was with in the moment that polygamy was good. So that's the reason that this whole entire shit started was because of Isaiah. Right? And Wavy P wants to say that I don't want to play the voice notes. I didn't already told y'all about the voice notes. I didn't told y'all about um, the, the, the good king versus bad king. And how he was going to DM my queen and shit like that and say all this bullshit. I've already told that. I've already spoke that story. Wavy P took it out of context because he thought that I was talking about now. Right? Wavy P just wants it for the clout. But Wavy P don't understand that I was going to go to New York. We've, like, we've already bought tickets and things like that to New York five, six months from now. And that, that's when we were going to meet up and, and record these YouTube clips, these YouTube spiritual comedy clips. So those voice notes that he was going to play, y'all, Wavy P took them out of context, which is why he won't play the entire full thing. Exactly. Exactly. Right? Exactly. I mean, exactly. I've already said this and spoke about this, right? So, he sh so he's trying to tell y'all something that I've already spoke about, right? That I've already explained that he took out of context. Me and Zoe are going to New York six months from now. Y'all are going to see us in New York in six months. This is when Wavy and I were going to meet and build on some real videos, on some real shit on YouTube. In the whole meantime, we were going to build up our own platforms. So Wavy P took it out of context, what I was saying, and then now that he's being exposed, now that I'm coming for his neck, he wants to try to play that little segment, that like the little segments, right, the little minute segments, to, to try to create some last minute clout, is, is before this nigga's washed out the conscious community, right? So this dude the entire time was trying to engineer, why did I build with him? Oh, this is weird, I've like, already explained it. We connected on a, 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 a comedic perspective. We, con we connected on that comedy frequency, right? And this is what people don't understand. Is that we connected on that. Yo, can y'all hear me? Yo, we good? Yo, we good? Right? We connected on the comedic frequency only. And then Solar called Wavy and me out. Right? So we, we were kind of forced together to, is, is to kind of join and do it. Right? So we, like me and we we're going to uh, create key and pill skits in a spiritual higher frequency form. Is to bring comedy and to bring laughter to y'all's Instagram and to y'all's YouTube. That's the only reason why we built in the first place. And those voice notes were off those type of bills that we were going to do in New York when I was going down there six months from now. And I'm still going down there. So Wavy P really about that work. I'm go, I'll, nigga, I'll be down there in six months. If, like, if you really about that work. Facts. But people want to act like, you know, like, people now want to come in and be like, so what happened? You know, so what happened? So I'm just telling you what happened from my perspective, how Wavy's trying to use this as a way to create clout. The same way he used that suicide video on Naomi, right? The same way he tried to use that video on her to basically discredit anything that she was saying to, like, basically prove that she was crazy, she was suicidal, that she wasn't mentally there, right? So... Yeah, right. So he's, he, he he's trying to use the same tactic to discredit me, right? But we see it. Oh no, see Ty Sharon, like you haven't been following me the last year, and spiritual speaking, Seven can speak on it. Kiss the Vel can speak on it. Um, I know for a fact, um, in streak abundance of love can speak on it, right? 
And they can speak all day. I used to do lives every day with 10, 15, 20, sometimes three people, four people in the live stream. So I'm not doing this. For, I've been doing this shit for the last two years, right? And and you can tell, right? Based on my Instagram, based on the past Instagrams that I have, right? And for everybody that's really been in it. So Sharon, you can say that, but you haven't been following me well enough. And I'm explaining why all the new followers, right? And Poitras, like Poitras tuned into my lives. It, like, I know Poitras on a personal level, you know what I mean? So it's like, he's tuned into my lives. He's my friend. My friend. I don't believe in that type of rhetoric that the enemy of my enemy is my friend.